missed that, I think. Uh, no. Yeah. I think I got it. I think I got oh, okay, it. Okay, okay. That's fine. All right, cool. Wait, wait. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah. <laughs> I, just make, I was just making sure. The <laughs> laptop just stops working. He's like, nah. <laughs> Charge is working. Bed is squeaky. Living the friggin' dream. We're in Sydney. I think you do the intro. Like as welcome to this oh. podcast. <laughs> welcome everyone to the Official Zing Podcast. I am your host, Alex Rogers, and with my friendly co-host who is in Sydney, Cody Simons. No, no. <laughs> not, not a noise from you, except a sub. No. What do you guys think of the setup? First of all, I think. What do you think of it? Sorry, new official setup. Just imagine, really nice view of the city behind here, like penthouse. No, I would agree. It's a great view from the city. It's playground. We actually closed this one because the lights were blaring, and two, there is a playground with children. A lot of children. A lot of children. Small children. So we're like probably not a good idea to have. And I that. was previously standing here with my underwear on, and that's it. Yeah, you didn't realize. But kids, I don't think kids really care. Do you think they can see from up here? No. I don't. I don't think so. I reckon there's too much of a glare, and there's like you can probably see the pattern. There's like a bars, so you you don't <laughs> jump. Um, so <laughs> you don't jump, not because it looks good. So you don't jump. It looks horrible, mate. You think? Uh, from the it's, it's blocking the way. I would say from the inside it looks awful. From the outside, I didn't. I didn't notice. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Yeah. Anyways. So look at it. That when when Aaron first opened this, it looked it looked a bit sus. For our blind listeners, Cody Aaron, our lovely friend Aaron Davy, has bought a uh black pink what is it light stick? He's got a bought a light pink stop Sorry, sorry. <laughs> a light light pink um fucking stick. Thing. It's got black pink and yeah on it. so he opened it and it's legit when we first saw it the first thing we thought of was a uh I'm it, it looks like a penis it looks like a sex toy it does um, i think it's the color and the shape of the index because it's, it's pink and black at the same time which is two colors to you just, which, yeah i'm just saying it's it it's a sex toy um yes. do you think aaron had the same thought when he poured it out definitely but I feel like he likes it too much to acknowledge it, which is fine. And there's going to be thousands of them at the concert tonight. It's so good. Which is a it's good even better point. that they're shaking it too. And smacking <laughs> the shit out of it with that noise. But as you heard before, when Cody smacks it, it squeaks. Yeah. So. That's all you're going to be hearing at that's, the concert. And I'm talking there was thousands and thousands of them. So there's probably going to be a lot of squeaking. Yes. For those who don't know, we are going to go see a Blackpink That's concert. That's exactly the reason why we're in Sydney. Yeah. It's a Blackpink concert in Sydney. Um, Aaron really likes K-pop. He went to go see Twice, was it? In I have no I think it was Twice in I'm Melbourne. I'm going to talk about that. And um, now he's going to go see this in Sydney. He's brought us with him. He's brought us with him. We had him. no choice. <laughs> I was forced here. It's no matter not, what. It's not true. I had no, I, if I said no, he said too bad. I bought four tickets. Fuck you. <laughs> I love how you say that. Be like, if we went without you, you'd be like, guys, what the fuck? No, I'm, I'm here for Sydney. Yeah. That's it. Which is, but, yeah. Yeah. Which yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I mean, what I'm, do you think the concert's going to be like? Have you seen any clips on the internet of a Blackpink concert? Well, Aaron sending clips in from the Twice one. Yeah. I'm just expecting that, but just probably more passion because they're, I didn't realize how big back, back pink. Yeah. Black pink. <laughs> See, I don't even know what they're called. <laughs> I, I didn't realize how big they were. So we got to the stadium that they're playing at. There's people lining up 12 hours before. Yeah. So Aaron, to get that light stick, Aaron had to go to the merch line. And next to the merch line is the lineup for the concert. The concert doesn't start till eight o'clock tonight. As yeah. in, we don't get to go in till eight o'clock tonight. Um, crazy. I yeah. don't understand how there's people sitting down just chilling. And we we we, we went on the plane, so we were, our day goes like this. Mm. We woke up at four o'clock to an alarm. All, all, all four of us, all four of us to woke up to an alarm, and um, it's really hot. You can keep going. I know. I'm just watching you. Oh, we do the Aaron, where yeah. he just sips and goes. <laughs> <laughs> so no what hey yeah we woke up at four o'clock all got up went to the airport at quarter to five quarter to five and then we 
we went to you distracted me so much with that bloody coffee well first off let's 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 start off with you and aaron got three hours sleep two we three did. hours sleep. yeah that's true me and lance got five minutes <laughs> yeah uh i don't know what it was with me and lance i mean i, I was show from my point of view i was just laying there with my eyes closed and nothing was happening yeah i was trying to think of things that could lead into being a dream mm-hmm. that would maybe help just didn't know i was just laying there and then I'd become sweaty and then I have to move over and then I'll be even more awake. Yeah, that's true. So yeah, Wide we, awake. I mean, we all we all got up at quarter to four, left to go to the airport, got to the airport at quarter to five, would you say? Yeah, a bit later than we expected. Yeah, quarter to five. We all got breakfast and then we what was it? What do we do next? We all pretty much just waited and hung around and kind had, of had chilled. Macas, waited for a bit, yeah. Yeah. Then we got at, we got on the plane at twenty past six. Mm got here on, took an hour and a half plane ride from Adelaide to Sydney hmm. then from there we Aaron went to go put his two bags away went on a train <laughs> yeah went on a train finally got to the Blackpink line at what 11 10 o'clock maybe yeah yeah to yeah. find that maybe around a kilometer a kilometer and a half of a line hmm. was there for Blackpink who starts maybe in 11 hours? Yeah. Holy shit. This, I didn't realize how much passion there's in this <laughs> industry. That is nuts, music. right? It's a whole different kind of... It's, all different. it's just totally different compared to whole, Liam oh. Nilsson. He doesn't make music. Liam Nilsson. Maybe if he did stand-up comedy, he might get a line. I don't know. I don't, think I'd, I don't think I'd wait that long for him, you know? I think I'd maybe... Like an hour. Do you think Kevin Hart would get a line like that? Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. I think he'd have... If... Yeah, but what I don't understand is people pay like thousands, maybe hundreds to like near a thousand dollars for a front row ticket. To they might then, not even get it, first of all. Yeah, to then not be able to get into the front row, to then, you know what I mean? Like, there's a lot of risk into getting a big risk expensive reward, ticket. I guess, but we got the cheapest, but we are the very first row on the seats oh so really we got very very lucky I so no what, there's idea. us at the very front and then it's just the mosh pit oh shit it's not it's not a mosh pit in k-pop but, but, it's just like a standing up i think thing. it i mean yeah, I was there say, won't be any mosh pits at it k-pop. won't be a mosh pit but it'll be like a crowd of people just jumping crowd jumping yeah. it'll be like a club it'll be a club scene where people are like yeah let's do it it's that's what i'm expecting to club be honest scenes. but um yeah you're you're running on no sleep Four hours prior of you um, coming up to my house before we left, which was what, like eight? Yeah, I'd say so. Yes, eight, so eight I got home at two, slept till six, six thirty. Oh, so was... you had like a four and a half hour sleep then? Yeah, but I haven't slept since then. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. It is currently Friday afternoon and I have still have to go to this concert. We'll have a nap after this, I guess. We're going to have to. We'll come home and we'll collapse. I know. Instantly. You were like, all right, man, here's the idea. This is before we left for Sydney. He was like, here's the idea. After the Blackpink concert, we'll do a podcast and we'll That's review what, yeah. it. And I was like, absolutely not. <laughs> we will crash. Because we'll- I wanted our fresh thoughts of the concert straight after it. Yeah, but I already feel like we've already like, we've gone through, th- we've gone through so much already just for this concert, which makes it way too funny. This is our first time being home. Or inside a house since four in the morning. So yeah. It's been a long day for And us. we've only been in this place for, what, half an hour, yeah. 45 minutes? Uh, when I go to bed, no, I don't I'm know. so tired. I was very, very, very tired. When we, were, we, we, weren't, we weren't shopping. We were just exploring, yeah. I guess you could say. And um, I think just like not moving and just sitting in a comfy chair or laying down for a bit is just like Draining. maybe not tired. Oh, Okay, not not tired. No, not as tired. Like because like, my shoulders were hurting from the backpack. Yeah, true. Like, I got no weight on. I, now when we go out, I can just put my stuff in my pockets and I'm good. I don't have yeah. to wear this massive backpack on my head. How do you think I feel? <laughs> my, back, my backpack is bloody huge. I yeah. love it though. I do love that backpack. But you got more support in I terms have, of shoulders and straps. So I have three layers of support. Yeah, I have like crazy. I literally have like this like belly strap, which is kind of like a belt. Then I've got like another strap, just normal shoulder straps. And then I've got like a strap that conjoins those. Yeah. Not to mention like three layers of padding in each of the bags. So the bag, instead of the bag, all the weight being pulled down here, it's just like... It's all in the core. Yeah. It's all here. But that's so much easier than the shoulder. The only thing that hurts is my neck. 
Yeah, my neck was hurting. Because I was like, I must have been looking. To, like, <laughs> your bag's pulling you back, but your neck's yeah. like that. It's like a chicken, you know, when you move the body and the head stays in the same place. I felt like that. Really? Oh, what a morning. Uh, what a day. It's uh, it's like, it's what, not even, it's. it's there's still more to come to. It's, it's only 3.23. Oh my god! We've only been in here for this like, day's been very long, only because of the fact we woke up at three fifty in the morning. That is very true. Waking up to in industry baby, which was really really funny. That's <laughs> we were joking about it then, like just before we went to sleep, and the moment it happened, it was as funny as we were imagining it. Yeah. So I don't know if we've told the story in the podcast yet, but when we when me and the other boys went to town. I had to get up for work the next day. And I'm talking like Stupid a... Stupid boy. I had three hours of sleep. Stupid. Yeah. So to wake myself up, I put like 15 different alarms on. All within like... I oh, 15. Bit of an exaggeration. Maybe like five. So every 15 minutes, there'd be an alarm just so it eases me to get up. One of those alarms were already preset. Mm. And that was industry baby. And that was, to, that was for Tokyo. When I woke up, I was like, there was a joke between me and a guy called Chris where we would listen to Industry Baby to hype ourselves up, you know, sarcastically. It was a hype song. Then I must have just changed the time on that alarm with that song. So when it played at Lance's house when we were all getting up, Aaron heard it, Jackson heard it, every, everyone heard it. And they were all like, what the fuck is that? So <laughs> it, it just became like a joke to the point where we just played it. What well, we all try to sync it up at the same time. Yeah, I had, I tried to have my light, my bedside light go off at the time, exact time. Yeah. Um, industry BB came on, but they didn't work. Mm. Well, there's a thing. I turned it automatically. There was a thing I've heard on a another podcast called Fuckface, mm. where this guy, his name's Gavin, he puts an alarm on, say at nine forty five. Mm. Then he puts another alarm on at nine forty six, mm. so that he I don't like you don't have enough time to turn off the first alarm. And fall asleep by the time the second alarm comes on. So when the first alarm goes off, are you not instant? No. I oh, am. Yeah. It's not like that for me either. Because you, you, when you set an alarm, you probably want to go do something, right? No, no. When I set my alarm, I instantly want to turn it off so I have more time. I get than that. Not listening to it. No, I get that. But it's like you know what I mean. Where it's like if you have an alarm on, you more likely have something you want to go do. Whereas yeah, when I have I an alarm on, I have to go to work. So turning that alarm off is like a little stoppage for me. Where I'm like. <laughs> Not today. I'm not going to hey, work man. today. Listen, you got to do what you got to do to get money. Hey. If it's $20, it's $20. You know how the saying is. Yeah, but like, it's just not how it's going to be. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> but yeah, that was like the whole story behind Industry Baby and all that. <sighs> <What's>, uh, <laughs> man, I'm, <gasps> I'm so tired. <laughs> I've been sick for the past two days, but I'm so glad I, I'm a lot better than I, yeah, I was yesterday. I did a lot of drugs. Medication. Medication's Drugs. a better way to put it. <sighs> Drugs is a funnier way to put it. <laughs> um, so what's the plan for the rest of the city trip? Because I have no well, idea. we have... So we will know the concerts tonight. After that, we come home, mm-hmm. have something to eat. Obviously do another podcast. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, have something to eat, then pass out. Yeah. Uh, next morning, I say we sleep in just a little bit. Just a, just so like 11, 30, 12, 1, 2. Oh, fuck that, <laughs> yeah. man. I say like 9, 10. Yeah, maybe. Um, and then, fuck. And then we have what the whole day to go do whatever we want. I don't yeah. know. Go to the Sydney Opera House, go to the bridge. Yeah, we got stuff to do. We got Try not to spend too much I've money. never been to a holiday where like I've got no reason to go for the, like, the next three days. So we booked this and we're like, when's the concert? Friday? It's the first day we get. When, when are we going? Yeah. Friday. Yeah. What day do we come back? Monday. 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 Why the hell are we going out? Like what? I'm like, like trying to trying to piece it together why we went so for so long, but now I'm just like I have no idea what I'm gonna be doing. Well, it's, it's like when we went to Melbourne for the F1. We had the F1 for the first three days, and then we just had the next it's like four days to do whatever we wanted yeah. to. We could then one of those nights we're staying up late and sleeping in. That was a good one. That was a good one. We slept into like eleven, twelve. Yeah, that was bad. But we deserved it because we were out. <laughs> All day, we yeah, were exhausted the from the F one trip, man. We were no, cause that's a lot. That's a lot of walking. Yeah, now, that is just it's just you're just walking around a track. Yeah, like literally the most like exciting part of a day for a non F one fan was literally like, oh, we're moving to this spot now, <laughs> so we can see the cars go. Well, you're not, you're not as much a, as an F one fan as we are. Exactly. But what did would you say watching the cars is more entertaining than walking around the place? 
Yeah, definitely. But you know what I mean? Where it's like, if I had... Shit, I'm so tired. If I had no interest in F1 and I was walking around, I think my like, highlight of my day would be like, I'm going to go get a snack and then we're going to move around. It's going to be hype. You know what I mean? Like, this is what it is. So, are we zooing, aquariuming? Oh, or yeah. Museuming? Oh, you have to go to the zoo. You have to go to the aquarium. I mean, I don't know, they only, they're like the main zoo I really yeah. want to go to. I love a good zoo, yes. and I love a good aquarium. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm... Maybe we should go to wet, slip and wet, wild slip. Wet, <laughs> slip and slide wild. The sea... Was there sea world here? Or like... It looked like there was. That It looked... Something like that. Well, we saw a really weird advertisement... In the airport. In, not in the airport, in the train station, where it was a picture of a fish... And it was like, yeah, it was like literally like paint the scene. Mm. It was like literally just like the bottom of an aquarium. There was like a lot of little fish, and there's one big fucking fish. Call it like I don't know a bass or whatever the fuck. And then it just said trains. They do yeah, it. That was confusing. It was like it was just said trains. <laughs> they do it. And then there's fish. And I was like, what are you? What? That was our sign to go home. Yeah, I was like, I was like, what am I looking we at saw right that now? And we're like, we're going home. Yeah, we need to walk. Like when I when we pulled up to this place, I'm like. I did not expect this. I thought it this was... This is really nice. If there was like a puzzle outside to get to... That was fun. I want to explain the puzzle because like... I so, don't think you should. Why not? Here's why I don't think it's fine. I think it's fine. Because no one's going to be able to track this down. Oh, you'll be surprised. Remember that guy on TikTok? He'll find this place. Just by the curtains. Go for it, man. It's like, it's... The worst thing is... I don't know, like... It was a heist to get in here, but yeah, it's it was like there was a easy. there was a it is a bench in like a playground, and then you've got to go unlock a certain padlock by using a code, and then using that code you get in. It's and then there's like another code and another door. I'm gonna have a second one of these. Put sugar. The espresso. Yeah. No. Nah. I die. Do you probably have a heart attack? That's dying. I uh, know you can survive a heart attack. Not with you guys around me. Oh, no. <laughs> we're medically together, we're useless. I, yeah, right. I had a Red Bull this morning. Yes. Wait, this morning or last night? <laughs> 4 a.m. in the morning, <laughs> I, had a, I had a Red Bull. I had two few hours before that. Wow. And I haven't had any anything else since. I had a hot chocolate, but that doesn't matter. You had a burger. I don't know. Okay, that has... <laughs> yeah, wow. Wow. Right. <laughs> Cool. I felt really proud of myself because when we went to go get that Macca's everyone was coming back with like whatever you got a coffee listen listen yeah. listen I had a hot chocolate nothing's yeah. better than a really early morning flight with a nice hot chocolate I don't know water definitely beat that today. water in the morning is the, one of the most disgusting drinks in human history it is or it isn't you need to get used to it first so hold on you can either have this, when you wake up it either can go two ways you wake up have a cup of tea brush your teeth Go to bed. No, go to bed. Go to work. Go back to bed. Go what back to fuck? bed. No, go to work. Or you can wake up, be thirsty as shit for no reason. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And then have the best, biggest drink No, no. Of water. It's like that 3 a.m. Like, oh my God, my mouth is dry yeah, as shit. Have you... Like, it would be the most disgusting water. Yeah. But it's so nice at the same time. Yeah, right? It's just like, I'm waking up and I'm drinking this. And I'm like, I could throw up from this, but I'm like... Oh, but it's so good. Get it down my gullet, bro. Yeah. Like that is the best, but like for some reason I have no idea why my brain just wakes me up in the middle of the night being like, "Hey bro, you need to drink some fucking water." Like I just don't get it. Do you not drink water before bed? No, no I mean I guess you'll piss yourself. Yeah. And then no, you know, you know, you're not a kid anymore. So. No, you are though. Oh, fuck off! No, <laughs> I made it here. I'm fine. True, true, true. A true, kid true. would be asleep right now. And I lanced you, fuckhead. <laughs> you kid. This poor guy. He's been bullied all day. <laughs> Oh, you're like, I, I don't, he knows it's a joke so he's a joke I, think, so. I, I mean I hope could you imagine like we get famous and then Miles just comes out and tweets those guys are like, fuckheads to me those, those guys are assholes fuck those guys well he he stole the room instantly when he came in here yeah so just instantly dibs it yeah he got last pick because he lost a competition and then we had to now I have to sleep on this thing which is luckily a bed in itself it can actually fall it falls yeah. back it's folds, kind of leaning on the it falls back Cody has this sofa bed, which has an air mattress. You might be thinking, oh, that's nice. No, it's rock solid. Yeah, it is. And it's deflating as we speak. It's <laughs> fucking nuts. It's like, it's, I laid on it and I was like, I'm pretty sure I can feel my ass. This hitting. is com- more comfortable, which is surprising t- comparing this to an air mattress. Yeah. But the pillow's comfortable, so it's, it's 50-50. It's, it's fine. Oh, great. 
And it's also there's a lot of shit on it right now, I guess. Yeah, I've, I prob- we're gonna have to. I threw that. all of my shit yes. on there. Yes. Gonna um, have to move that. So. And then there's Aaron's bed, which is a deluxe. To be fair, he did organize and pay for this at first, so yeah, he true. gets the he gets the king, queen, whatever it is. Nah, totally fair, totally um, fair. And but, he's also like telling us what trains to go on, what buses, what times, when to do this, that when to guy, do that. Where's this place? He's very prepared. He's our fucking dad. He's our dad. I love trip. it. Nah, it's great. Have you ever like thought about being the dad for a trip? No. No, right? I've never been that guy. I'm just not good with trains. I know. Especially in a different state. I'm fine with here because. I mean, I've been, I've, no, no, what I mean here, I mean Adelaide. I'm fine with being in Adelaide because I know the trains and I know where they go and all that mm. stuff. But here, we're looking like T3, this platform t- 4. No, nah, like, that's... Fuck, which one's that one going to? I just don't know where we are. No, nah, I'm lost. Talking, speaking of the dad. Oh my God, we're talking about our dad. Our it dad walks in. Dad. Hi, dad. Dad? <laughs> Hi, dad. We went to Coles. You know, he went to go get the milk. He didn't get primed. So hold on, he, he went to he went to go get the milk and came back. That's surprising. He yeah, got twisties as well. Did you actually? What did you get? Lay it out for us. Oh, that is a heavy bag. What do you reckon your favorite kind of chip? That's hard because there's a lot and they're all so close. Sorry, crisps, crisps, favorite chips. Uh, uh, probably prawn crackers. From what? Those prawn crackers from I don't know. I think it's from Coles. Not Cheetos. No. Cheese and bacon balls. No. They're great. I mean, I haven't had. I don't know. I don't. Eat, As if you don't, don't say don't Pringles anymore. Pringles. Maybe uh, I don't think. I think twist chicken twisties are probably number one. I don't know. Did you cut your hand? No. Just... Oh. Maybe. What's your favorite kind of chip, Aaron? <laughs> Ooh. Damn. Yeah, that's very specific. That's on good. Point. He just said prawn crackers. <laughs> they're, they're the barbecue prawn crackers. Oh, see, that's different. They're not just plain prawn crackers. Yeah. Uh, okay. Let me. They're barbecue prawn crackers. <laughs> <laughs> barbecue corn crackers. This shit's sending me to the moon. Yeah. Um. Here's something we can talk about that's pretty important basketball. We already did. Have we? In the last episode, we said we lost 61 to 27. No, I'm talking about actual NBA. Oh, the Nuggets won the final series. Yes, yeah. They won. What? Did, did you, you don't follow basketball. I know that's crazy. <laughs> the Nuggets. But did, what? I've never heard the Nuggets win anything. Denver Nuggets. Yeah. No, they had the best team. They had. Oh, not the Detroit team. Nuggets. But, <laughs> what the fuck? Detroit Nuggets? No, that's Detroit not Detroit Nuggets. It's. <laughs> When I picture Detroit that, Pistons. I was going to say, when I picture the just Detroit Nuggets, I picture a chicken nugget with a bandana on and a Glock. Detroit Nuggets. That's why you would never go to Detroit. No, never. Because you'd just be calling everyone Something nuggets. so, so wrong. Like, like, yeah, the Denver, Detroit. Anyways, they won. Yeah. And, I mean, they were, they were going to win that. So is that the ring? Yeah. yeah, they won the whole thing. The ring. They won the, the championship. One. What? But the funny thing is, Nikola Jokic, um, in the press conference, he couldn't care less about the championship. He just wanted to go home. What? Yeah, he, he like he's a he's. People say bar his basketball is his nine to five, and he goes home and races horses. <laughs> but the horse racing is like a it's like a you sit on the back of the like a carry thing. Yeah. Like whoosh, oh nice. Sit in it. So like coliseum type yeah. shit. Yeah. Like <laughs> medieval what? racing. Where does this come from? Oh, he's Serbian. He's Serb. Oh. So I guess it's his background. No, that makes sense. Um, no, but he was like, I just want to go home and race horses. I've got to race this weekend or some shit like that. <laughs> that's kind of a flex where it's like, that's his job. Like, that's not his hobby. That's his fucking And there was job. a photo where everyone else, when they win the championships, hugging the trophy. He's just drinking a beer. <laughs> is this true? Yes. Is this, is, this doesn't sound like a real person. And, and then I think it was between game one and game two. They're like, what do you do in between game one and two? He's like, uh, I do. I'd watch Pokemon for five hours. <laughs> My fucking guy, what is this for? Yeah, he's... what? I don't know. I don't know how to, how to explain it. Can we he's get just... his like rookie card? He's just a floppy dude. Can we? Just... Dude, we should start collecting people like that, like rookie cards. To Aaron <laughs> like Aaron just gestured he has a huge cock. 
<laughs> and then you, you flop just anyway yeah i feel like as a as a podcast we should start making getting collectibles just to, collectibles are expensive though right would that be expensive i feel like they're you know expensive is a word i can't pronounce anyway i'm saying there should be enough cards so it won't be that pricey that might be i don't know there's probably heaps of variants in yeah we let's go through just... the bag let's go through the cold bag yeah Grab the of course me. I've, I've to, oh i've got a guitar in front of me oh thanks man thanks, hold on so, yeah he knows <laughs> you're welcome thanks <laughs> sorry to... thank you all right all right, <laughs> right. <laughs> I got right one by one let's what have we got jesus all right Nacho, nacho cheese Doritos. Nachos. And it's wet. $57. $57? Alright, let's... Twisties. Chicken twisties. A receipt. <laughs> you saved $2.45. Nice. Uh, hash browns. <laughs> oh, that's probably the wet Cook, thing. Start cooking them. Start cooking them. Snakes. Uh, out of 10, would you rather chips or snakes? Chips. That's fine. Yeah. Especially, especially on a night. Yeah. yeah. Booze! <laughs> Booze! Vodka! Oh, that's my favorite. That's Fiji. No, no. I want this show. Fiji. Who did you get these for? You? Uh, <laughs> I'll take six. <laughs> um, oh, how can we forget? The sponsor of the video, Mountain Dew. And batteries. <laughs> get your energy surge however oh, you need. Yeah, my, and... Uh, yeah, you feel a little black pink thing. One Red Bull. Oh, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Aaron, how much did you buy for us? You can have all the chips and hash browns. That's what I said. And then I was like, oh, you know, I'm gonna <laughs> He's like, you guys gonna have chips and okay, a you drink? Can have snakes, no, no. Oh, yes. Oh, man. You're so sort of. You having one now? Yeah. Fucking gronk. <laughs> a long way from home. It is 3 40. And oh. the thing doesn't start till 8. I'm guessing you're not going hammered to this thing. No. Well, Last famous words. No, no, it's a I nice. Mean, you bought six. So... Yeah. It's an early. Four. 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 Like two. Four. I mean, I'm not like, have five. have as many as you would have on like a chill, cool night. I don't know. So that's five. seven like for you. It's not. Seven, How much do yeah, I? Have a case. I do you. not. <laughs> I do not drink as much as you think I do. Oh, what? The, the pictures of when you go out is pretty horrific. So. Oh, yeah, I, I would, it's no link, no link. Is there a bomb going on? <laughs> Jesus. Anyway, I want to talk about outside. Speak. I don't go outside, so here's why. Why? The playground. We're gonna go on the slide. We're gonna film it. The slide is, is a torpedo. It's just down a hill. That's all it is. It's constantly okay. Different. It kind of starts off like it, medium. It eases it, and then it turns and it goes down. So it just pretty much just shows children the the meaning of life it's like it's you hit a, the side and then you go down it's a little fun and then everything sh- every just shit hits the fan <laughs> everything goes downhill so quickly when i'm gonna go down there i'm gonna go on a jumper and tracky so i got maximum slidiness i'm gonna go down in shorts and a shirt and a you're gonna get burnt yes, i'm gonna go down in a shorts and a wife beater and i'm gonna see how many bruises i get going down because like again it is, it, but you're fat and heavy yeah right <laughs> i'll come out like a projectile so like like Aaron's poopoo today. <laughs> a bit. <laughs> Aaron. You gotta put the message on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so uh, we'll, we'll we'll have to come up with a little bit of context to that. The, they can see the photo. When they, when, they there's no photo. It. So yes, this is. I'll take a screenshot of the. Yeah, true. I did save that. Actually, saved you the saved message. it. So yeah, because it was like he he had two Red Bulls, and Aaron being Aaron, he can't handle caffeine very well. So, you had one? <laughs> you had one. Yeah. That does not make the story any better for you. It just came right out. Yeah, so you must have just... It, must have it just, came in. Yeah, that's horrific. Wet and loose. Runny. Runny. <laughs> runny, runny poo. <laughs> Anyways, I want to know, how was your flight on the way here? Did you enjoy it? Did you find it miserable? Were your knees aching? My knee did ache, because I mean, right. I have... It was, there was no room. I have a problem with my knee, so it hurts a lot. But I played about three different Nintendo Switch games on the trip here. That's when I know that you were getting a bit bored. Yeah, because I like... The first game I booted up was a game we've already mentioned called Shaq Fu. Shaq Fu is a game that I remember being great. 
And this, Alex got this game for 60 bucks. <laughs> it's pre-owned too. Pre-owned as well. I didn't even... And it's called... Shaq Pre-owned Fu. Shaq Fu Nintendo Switch. A legend A legend reborn. Or a legend reborn. How much do they go for now, Shaq Fu? I don't know. But first of all, that doesn't look like Shaq like, in the slightest. <laughs> well, it's a very racist game. He hasn't got his... His Man of Steel tattoo. No. What do you mean as a racist? Could you pass me my... Actually, could you search this up for me as our producer for the show? Can you please search up how much Shaq Fu, a legendary born, goes for? Because if it's more than $60... It's going to be like 30 bucks now. Because if it's more than $60... It's going to be pre-owned as well. (laughs) By Shaq. Oh, it had to be signed. It's the only copy printed. $20. Fuck's sake. You could have bought it on your PC for $20. Fuck. Oh, inf- but inflation. That would be less than 60, but listen, it looked like you weren't enjoying the game. No, so I got in and I was like, this game is ass. And then there was like an enemy that was like a drag queen. Yeah. And I was like, this is a very whoa kind of game. I'm like, this is this is going to this is going to far and wide for it. Shaq Fu, a legendary born, twenty three dollars. EB games. EB Yours games. Truly. And I got mine from Game Traders. That's how old that fucking game, game is. Game traders, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> Are you fucking 60? Do you remember game traders Not really. going from just games to like more figurines? No. No, I I haven't been in, in a game traders probably ever. I don't remember. Game traders, traders moved from Marion down to Glenelg. That's probably why I haven't mm. been there fucking years. So, yeah. So, we were... I remember going to game traders. That's where I bought all my games from. Never went from EB Games. That was a pussy store. Game traders only. So I went there and then eventually they stopped selling games or trading them in mm-hmm. and they went to Pop Vitals. And then Game Traders just disappeared and it became the Pop Vinyl shop. There's no games. No games. Why would they do that? And then the Pop Vinyl shop immediately closed. And to this day, eight years later, they still could not keep a space for that Game Traders. Game Traders is haunting that place consistently. But yeah. I don't know what to say. No, seriously. That's why I haven't seen it in years. Yeah. It's gone. GME, GameStop. 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 We, don't, we know EB, GameStop, the... What's the other one? Yeah, oh yeah. For those who don't know, EB Games is GameStop. Oh, is that... We yeah. Don't have GameStop, here, do GameStop. We? Yeah. we don't have GameStop in Australia. So GameStop is EB Games. It's Game... like how our Burger King is Hungry Jacks. Yeah. That, that type of shit. Which is ridiculous. We, I wish we had Burger King. We all wish we had Burger King. Uh, oh! We haven't. We have. We've never had Taco Bell before. Holy shit! And there's shit. a Taco Bell. It's a twenty minute walk, <laughs> but at a Macca's and ta- is a Macca's and Taco Bell right next to each other. Yeah. I'm. So, I, I'm ready to shit my pants. If you do, I was gonna say, if you have like Macca's instead of Taco Bell, what the fuck's wrong with both. you? I'm not. I haven't tried Taco but Bell. I'm. I want to shit myself. Yes. Yeah. Taco Bell was known for horrendous aftermaths. I'm so mad about that. Isn't it like? I just I, so I mean, to this day I still get mad about that Taco Bell, the one in Melbourne, the one that got away. <laughs> it was brand new, first oh, day, first day open. We were in Melbourne for F one. Me, Aaron, our friend Dash, our friend Jackson, and you, and we were all going to Taco Bell for dinner because it was the first day opening. We were hyping it up because we were like, it's gonna open while we're here. This is crazy. We got there. We drove about what forty five to fifty minutes. To get remember. there, it was a long it was trip. A long, it was a longer trip. We got there, power was out. Power was out, by the way. And then we were trying to walk in. We thought it was open to see employees like sitting down. Yeah, and like, there's people in the fucking like kitchen still cooking, and there was like new employees sitting on the on the kitchen counter and like on the benches and shit. I'm talking shit about Taco Bell right now. This is, you know who you are. We're never gonna get sponsored by them. That's fine. Um, and I was like, what the fuck. We're all, we're all super angry because we're like, they're just not letting us in. We drove all this way and it's pitch black out just yeah. to not get any time. And then we, while we're walking away, like the people are like, looking at us and like giggling and shit. Um, so so we, we actually just absolutely destroyed them in the we, comments section. We destroyed them in the reviews. I think I wrote, what is the point of closing early on your first day? I wrote like this horrendous review mm. and I got an email this week about it because it, like it was like a year pretty much. And it was like, your review has 3,000 views. And like 15 other It's actually insane how many people actually look at reviews for just random yeah, man. shit. I also did a review for the dentist. Why? Because they did a really good job. 
I was like, I felt like an old man, but I was like, this dentist did a great job. <clears throat> Gave it five stars. Downvoted all the bad ones. Yeah, we all said something. Some some of them got likes. Some of them. <laughs> I said, <laughs> I said, Requies is inbound. It got deleted. <laughs> too scared. By Taco Bell. Yes. <laughs> they weren't ready for a quiz. <laughs> Fuck them. Yeah. He's still coming. No, that's, I rate that though. That's, that's good for you. He's taking his time. Yeah. That's all. is inbound to a different Taco Bell in Sydney. How's he, that drink? It's really good. I'm getting away with like that. ginger beer? It tastes exactly like ginger beer. This is great. It's exactly one standard as well, so... It's like it's like a that minus one nine six or whatever the fuck. No, that's like you can kind of tell the vodka's yeah. 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 That's tangy, like they go It just feels like I'm having a Bundaberg ginger beer, <laughs> but I'm not. <laughs> Who's waking Lance up? There's not. We should all. I mean, right, when is time? I was just saying, not right now, man. Maybe we should throw some cards at him, like you know how you grab cards and just yeah, do that. Fucking finger. Anyway, him. on the back to the plane. <laughs> back to. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you're right you're, you're part of this yeah you're the producer now you get used to this bucko um so yeah we'll use the light stick and we'll just film like a little short just, like smacking it speaking of shorts your your tiktok oh can we, we can show it on youtube right yeah i'm Fuck sure it. it's coming up on stream now i got a what's it called community guideline shit yeah you got striked you got striked for Is it a strike yeah and you've already got a strike. So I got one more and I'm out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you're done. There's no way you're coming back. The other one I shot by Bear Bum. <laughs> with James Charles. Um, this one. It's I not, can, not as, it's I not was, bad. We were all, I mean, we were wearing underpants. Nothing was showing. There was a lot of skin. That's it. But like, there was, like you see all these women. <laughs> like, just in bikinis and stuff. And they're just, they get Ghosted. Like, <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> we love it man this is great <laughs> double standards oh and the shit they get away with and we can't even show you fainting no with your boxes on <laughs> they make money off it. they make so much money yeah that's probably why they're allowed it though because they make money they're probably like a twitch partner or something to get in the views yeah twitch Men just don't get views twitch we twitch oh twitch our first stream on twitch oh my god yeah we streamed uh, Aaron gave us a thumbs up. This is a good topic. It's Aaron streams as well. Aaron streams at, um, ironically, what is it? Blackpink Lover. Uh, Blackpink Lover? <laughs> <laughs> it's Blackpink Forever XOXO or some yeah. shit. Um, but no, the official Zinged streaming. It was out of nowhere, first of all. We were just like, let's do it. We're yeah. Like, well, to be fair, it was a test stream. Yeah. And it did very well. It went way too far. Because we were like streaming for two hours. We got an average of what? I think it, it was an average of 10 viewers. Now, that doesn't seem like a lot. But for, for a first stream for that a, has like at the point zero followers. Yeah. That's amazing. That's bonkers. And considering like two of them were from Bulgaria. Yeah. We got like one was like, I'm from Bulgaria. And then one of the, another person chimed in and was like, I'm also from Bulgaria. There's this Jacko guy who came in as well. Yeah, Machete Weird. Monkey. Fuck that guy. Weird <laughs> he went, guy. He literally left the stream to go get food. Okay. Um, I already hate him. But no, it was a really, really good stream. Yeah, I enjoyed, I enjoyed myself. More to come. Sweatfest Sundays. A lot of, lot of what? Lots to come. Oh, I think it's a lot of come. A <laughs> lot of come. Sweatfest Sundays. Uh, coming at you every... You had the time thing, wasn't it? I think it's 11... It was 11... EST. EST. 11 a.m. EST. Yeah. Or 8 o'clock, something for us like that. Or it's just 8, 8, 8 30 Australia time. <laughs> I, PM. I don't even know what Australia time's on. What time zone are we? Southern? AM. PM. I don't know. <laughs> that's, just, that's just the time time. Time time. Talking about it, it is 4 PM. Is it really? The concert starts in four hours ish. <laughs> four hours and 10 minutes. I could have a nap. I might have a nap. You might have a nap. I might have an After old... having a coffee and, and a beer. And a beer. <laughs> ginger. Ginger beer. Oh, this, this hat's stuck on my head, bro. <laughs> oh, you bastard. All right. What else has happened in this past week for you? Nothing. You've been working. I've just been so excited to come out here and to Sydney. Yeah. See, now that I'm doing this, and now this is way more open, mm. if we ever do a proper set, definitely going to use one couch. This is great. You like it close to you too. I hate that. I think we... now. Nah, okay. Scratch that. You don't that. like the two couches. I want, two, two, I want okay. two separate couches. Yeah, good. I like it. 
No, this is a good setup where it's like there's stuff on the desk. Let's, we'll get there eventually. Yeah. Well, we're going to have to. Otherwise, we can't just keep staying at my mum's place. No, she's getting sick of us. No, you're, my dad is. I say, is your dad actually getting sick? No. I say, no, they, you can be honest. No, because my dad's just like, he's just, what does he say? He's like, I don't want to keep spending every Friday. Which is totally true. It's an hour. I don't want to send your parents in their room every Friday night. I will. I'll do it constantly. That's just torture. Well, it's week after week. I'm sure they can think of something to do. You can feel mine. It's fine. I like the setup that we have, though. We can switch it up, maybe. We can go back to that... Did you know podcast? Yeah. No. Question? I like this setup because it's different. My man. I like it. It's very... It's a lot lighter than yours. It's a lot brighter, yeah. There's nice curtains instead of yours that you don't like. There is a guitar, which does work. There's a guitar, there's food, there's beers, there's... Oh, you're going to play it? Be careful. Oh, it picked it up. I think we got a little bit. Is that the, that that'll be the chime of when we finish? <laughs> it just kind of happens out of nowhere. <laughs> Aaron, Aaron will tell us when we're done because we'll just walk over and just drive the guitar. <laughs> <sighs> I feel like a lot's happened this week and I'm missing out a lot. But I feel like I haven't seen any of you for the past week. Because you haven't. No. No. Oh, wait. No, you have. Because we've been out not planning, but just talking about what we're going to be doing in Sydney and. Yeah, that is very how true. We're gonna plan it. I don't know how. We, what is that? Whatever. We still got the aquarium. I mean, I'm keen to go to the aquarium. Are you more? Are you more keen for the zoo or the aquarium? More of an aquarium type of guy. <laughs> I don't know. I I really enjoy the aquarium. Ah. Not. I don't. I, I don't think know. I like the zoo. There's more in the zoo. That makes sense though. My I, family's I, there, so. I get it. I just don't like birds. We're going in the bird e- enclosure. Oh fuck that! Like, again, like in the one in Adelaide. So, like, I've held a bat. But I think that's the closest. That's so cool because they just hang up. They do. They're actually they really, don't do anything. They're really friendly until they start flapping their big fucking bingo wings. You wouldn't like Batman then, wouldn't you? I mean, Batman doesn't squeal at me. He might. He <laughs> could actually. I'm not. Oh, Batman! I don't know. <laughs> oh, Batman. <laughs> oh, God. Um, Listen, guys, it's been a fucking long day, right? Yeah, we are fucking destroyed right now. But I'm excited for the. We, 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 we're 40 minutes in it's good good we've got 10 more minutes i i want to talk about i said this last night before we tried to go to bed okay who has a harder life ants or worms aaron <laughs> ants or worms who has a harder life ants. i say ants why what where does this it come depends from? how you look at it yeah well where? worms can just be yanked out of the ground by a magpie yep at any given time and ants can't well magpies don't eat ants well we don't know that I do. <laughs> With what sauce? Magpies don't go around eating ants. No, true. But I feel like something does. Ant eater. But I think, I think, I, I heard this before, like ants, they are nine to nine every day, seven days a week. Oh, wow. Like, you know, because they don't stop working. No. They don't sleep, I don't. No. Do ants sleep? I presume. Do ants get AIDS? Maybe. How do they have sex? They don't. It's the queen, isn't it? No, I think so. Do they all have sex with the queen? No, maybe. Well, the queen. No, I feel like the, I, no, because I feel like can't the queen choose? How the, do worms have sex? I think they. they, they there's a lot of questions in there. I the worms have AIDS. Who has sex? <laughs> Not me. <laughs> Till never. Uh, I reckon a worm has a penis, but it's like microscopic. Microscopic penis. I've heard that nickname before. I didn't really heard. Microscopic this. penis. <laughs> oh, it's right next to me. <laughs> It's the guy sleeping in the next room. <laughs> the guy sleeping in the, the end. To the I door. feel mean. I don't want to rip on him, but he, he's asleep. But it's funny. He's not waking up till we actually wake him up. Pussy. <laughs> <laughs> I like that though. I read. <laughs> I like the setup. I can't wait for the second one. Honestly. This is great. I was... Yeah, I'm. I'm dozing. <laughs> I'm dozing. I'm dozing. And we have to have a shower and Are you for real? get ready. Yeah, true. Stop scratching your neck. I've been, I've been con- as soon as the hold on, is hold on, the arms come up. Hang on, we got a question. I'll see what time fuck about. That's not a question. Oh, it's, it's, <laughs> it's urgent. He's doing this. He shushed us on the podcast. <laughs> I thought he was like, hey, dude. <laughs> see of thieves. You excited? I'm excited. The first Sunday back from. Oh, we get back on Monday. Yeah, man. What? <laughs> we come back. Do we stream Mario Kart on Sunday? Mario Kart Monday. But we stream Sundays. Sundays we can stream whatever day we want. So, but the main thing is Sweat Fair Sundays. Sweat Fair Sundays. Which we stream every Sunday. Correct. 
11 EST. Yes. A- 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 AM, PM. I don't know what the fuck. Yep. Uh, and it's going to be Sea of Thieves. Correct. That series is starting. The VODs will be on the channel afterwards. Yes. So you don't miss anything. Yes. Uh, I'm excited. Honestly, our first Sea of Thieves stream could go to four hours. I'm, I'm Could go for a while. Honestly. Because like, apparently with Sea of Thieves, it's like you do one thing. And like, oh, I'm just gonna go do this another thing. I got like five more minutes. Like, oh, give me, just give me this. Yeah, it's like I just need to get this another treasure chest or some shit. And it's just like it's like that meme where it's like, all right, five minutes in and out, and the job will be done. And then he comes back like two exactly. years later. Aaron is cheering. Got a what, are you cheering? what are you cheering for, Aaron? <laughs> Found a good train. Perfect. Oh, wow, that's pretty good. That's See, that's what I mean, man. Glorious. I've yeah. Is how long it takes. What? Wow, fifty-eight minutes. That's Boys, charge get, your phone. Get a seat. I'm not gonna go on my phone because apparently my phone's retarded. Just, <laughs> yeah, your phone's dying. Like, I go, on, I go on Instagram, look at a story, then swipe out of the story, and I lost ten percent instantly. Wow, great. And that's uh, that's an iPhone. It's a ten. So wow, it ca- so, it came it's out, an iPhone though. The so iPhone is so much ago. better than every other phone. This is six, seven years old, mate. I mean, so is Aaron, but he doesn't charge. His phone has lasted all day. True. Using everything. How old? How old is your phone? Oh, it's legal. What? <laughs> what? Oh no, this is. It was born. It was born in uh, nineteen twenty-two. Nineteen twenty-two. That's that's not very legal. No, that's illegal. Twenty-two is fucking bad. So, no. Should we or should, should we? we not? To end this podcast, either go away, glance up, or go on the slide. Wake glance up with the VLAV mic on. What's the VLAV? The VLAV. The, yeah. the, uh, okay. We can be like, where you headed? <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Um, I think yeah. it's time. Wait, what was that? I'm hungry. I am hungry. Dude, brother, there's no way you're doing this on the end card. <laughs> you can't hear it. Yes, you can. Sorry, go, go, do it. This ASMR. Is- Producer, please. People will I can like, hear I can see people it online. People like that. People like that. Okay. I This has been the official Zinc podcast. I have been your lovely host. You just got shacked into food. <laughs> this is <laughs> What are we witnessing by the camera? <laughs> now the... it's working. It's working. <laughs> This has been the official Zinc podcast. I have been your lovely host, Alex Rogers. We have my co-host, the Roller Coaster, Cody. <laughs> co- co- coast. Oh, no, is it the Roller Coaster? Oh, the Co- ho. The Roller Co-host. Host, co- host. I'm a ho. It's, co- hoster. This has been the official Zinc podcast. I have been your host, Alex Rogers, and with my Roller Co-host, Coaster, uh, and with our producer Aaron in the background. Say bye, Aaron. Goodbye. I love that. <laughs> All right.